MGM Grand of Las Vegas. Bob Arams, Top Rank Incorporated, and Oscar De La Hoya's Golden Boy Promotions, in association with MP Promotions and Hatton Promotions, are proud to present the main event of the evening. 12 rounds of boxing for the IBO and Ring Magazine Light Welterweight Championship of the World. Sponsored by Rockstar, party like a rock star. Tecate, cerveza con carácter. Southwest Airlines, low fares, no hidden fees, and smart communications. Sanctioned by the Nevada State Athletic Commission, Chairman Bill Brady, Executive Director Keith Kaiser, IBO President Ed Levine. At ringside, the three judges scoring this bout, Michael Pernick, C.J. Ross, and Glenn Trowbridge. And inside the ring, your referee in charge of the action at the bell, Kenny Bayless. And now, with their places secured in the Hall of Fame, only one can become victorious tonight. So from the MGM Grand of Las Vegas for the thousands in attendance and the millions watching around the world, ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's get ready to rumble! <laughs> Waiting out of the blue corner with his head trainer, Floyd Mayweather Sr., wearing black with white and silver. Official weight, 140 pounds. Professional record, 46 fights. 45 victories, including 32 knockouts, with only one defeat. From Manchester, England, the three-time world champion and reigning defending IBO Ring Magazine Light Welterweight Champion of the World, Ricky Hitman Hitter. And fighting out of the red corner with head trainer Freddie Roach, wearing white with blue, officially weighing 138 pounds. Professional record, 53 fights. 48 victories, including 36 knockouts, three defeats, and two draws. From Sarangani Province, Philippines, the five-time world champion, currently recognized as pound for pound, the best fighter in the world, Manny Pac-Man Gentlemen, we went over the rules in the dressing room. I want to caution you to keep the fight clean at all times. Protect yourself at all times. And what I say, you must obey. Good luck. Touch up. All right. Let me tell you right now, you can unplug your television sets because the electricity in this building <laughs> will keep them running. Kenny Bayless, the referee, young, athletic, takes control of the ring. I think you probably need a good young mobile referee in there tonight with these two. Manny Pacquiao, the pound for pound champion, the Pac Man against Ricky the Hitman Hatton, for the junior welterweight championship of the world, and the title of best pound for pound fighter going. Live from Las Vegas, here we go. Here we go, gentlemen. Both on their toes. Both Hatton, with a lot of fire. Hatton coming very fast at Pacquiao. He seems intent 
and a lot of his pre-fight comments to show that he can also box tonight. But I think he's got to be the Ricky Hatton who comes forward and blasts away. Well, that was a big blast from Manny Pacquiao with a right hook right to Ricky Hatton's forehead. Well, it's going to be interesting to see how both these fighters come out. Trying to set the pace, Hatton talking about trying to be a different fighter. This is second fight under Floyd Mayweather Sr. And already a couple of shots to the body as he ties up Pacquiao and fights in close. And he's caught him court a couple times with that right hook coming in. I'll tell you who's going to be key in this fight is the referee. He's going to allow him to get, play into that style, to work into that midsection. Pacquiao working, uh, taking the shots to the body from Hatton, and this is turning into a brawl, which is exactly the kind of fight Ricky Hatton would want. Well, he's going to try to not let Pacquiao have a moment to relax. Pacquiao could basically sit back and pick apart Oscar De La Hoya because Oscar wasn't punching back. Well, Ricky Hatton is going to punch back, and he is going to punch first tonight. So it will be a different kettle of fish for Manny Pacquiao. Rich, you're exactly right. And not only that, there's lots of head movements, there's lots of feet movement, and the speed of, of, of uh, oh, and Pacquiao, Pacquiao hurt. Around. He caught Hatton leaning in with a big right hook, which he's going to have success with tonight if Hatton doesn't keep his hands up. And Hatton trying to hang on right now. Hatton cannot be too careless. Just check with Juan Manuel Marquez about what can happen in the first round against Manny Pacquiao. Well, this will be an interesting fight because neither one of these guys, as Pacquiao lands another right hand, was really challenged in his last fight. Oh, Kurt, Pacquiao a with shot a combination. Oh, head down here in the first round. Manny Pacquiao comes out two minutes into the opening round, and he's already knocked down Hatton. Kurt, the right hook was finding a home all the first round, and it ended up dropping the hitman some extra, hit the floor. Some extra seconds there for Hatton to recover, but he's in deep trouble with about a half a minute to go. And Ricky Hatton has struggled against southpaws previously and seems to be in a battle already as Pacquiao is just bringing it to him. Freddie what? Roach predicted the third round. He said it as a joke to annoy Mayweather. He might have been a little too conservative. And Hatton's in trouble again. Final 10 seconds of round one, and Hatton's down for the second time here in this opening round. If he beats the count, he'll get the 60 seconds rest. Six, and he seven, needs it. Eight, okay, he cannot be saved by the bell. Remember that. Unbelievable first round by Manny Pacquiao. What an impressive first round by Pacquiao. Pacquiao that is so unusual that he has to be labeled among the very greatest fighters who have ever stepped in a ring in any weight division. We did have a good shot there. You can see Ricky Hatton seems to have come. But he's getting outscored five to one, Hatton. The counter punch. And here he comes again, Pacquiao. The combination's doing damage on Hatton. And Ricky Hatton right now seems to be in survival mode as we get to the final 30 seconds of the second round needs to get to his corner just to catch his breath. The movement of Pacquiao keeping Hatton in trouble. Manny Pacquiao never fails to surprise me with what he brings to the table. It's always a little better than I thought. Oh, oh my God. Hatton down again. And now he might be out this time. Rich. That's it. Ricky Hatton is done. Not